I'm not aware of what youth guarantee is. The youth guarantee aims to ensure that all young people under the age of 25 years receive a good quality offer of employment, continued education or trainership and all those within a period of four months of becoming unemployed or formally finishing their education. Wow, that sounds amazing. It would be really nice to have a specialty just waiting for me when I finish. That sounds really good. Okay, so uh, let us start with the presentation. Let's hope that let, let's hope that let's hope that the other speaker will come in the meantime. Now, this is the first session of the of the uh, series of uh, online discussions bridge forum. Uh, organized by the Albanian NGO, The Bridge, with the support of uh, the, uh, the uh, Western Balkan uh, Youth Lab of the, uh, of the Regional Cooperation Council. And uh, it is also in cooperation with the ISEC, which is an association of students uh, you know, worldwide association, although they are students focused on economics and economic sciences, uh, they are also very committed to, uh, they are very committed uh, to intercultural uh, dialogue and intercultural uh, issues. Uh, in a way, so therefore, they, you view economic which is very important, they view economic as uh, uh, related to humanities. Um, I consider very important, especially at these times, economy is not just uh, GDP growth or, or um, just uh, certain statistics or numbers, or uh, it, is, it is much more than that. And the question of lowering price, prices going up or down or, or or the stock exchange going up or down. It is related, first of all, to, to people, to human beings. Uh, now, the, uh, and this is the focus of, uh, uh, of the ISEC and also of our own association. Uh, it is focus, this, uh, uh, the target of our, of our uh, discussions are not only as a public, but also as uh, the topics to be discussed, uh, is youth. Youth because it is, uh, in, in the Western Balkans, it is a vulnerable community. It is a vulnerable community, and uh, uh, at the same, as, as we can see by, by certain uh, statistics, or certain figures that we have, for instance, in order to have an idea about the situation. Uh, the average regional youth unemployment rate in 2020 is 35,1%, which is more than the double than in the European Union. Uh, also, there is a large gap uh, in youth labor force participating between activity rates for young men, it is average 36.5% against a rate for young women, 23.3%. 25% of, of youth from the Western Balkans are not in unemployment, education, and training. So this, this is a very sad situation. And that's why uh, we can say that it is, it is a vulnerable, vulnerable group. But at the same time, it is related to the perspective for both these reasons uh, we are focusing on on youth and on its uh, problems uh, in this uh, session the first session is focused on the topic is youth and economy the panelists are uh, 
Tanya Mishevich, which is Deputy Secretary General of the Regional Cooperation Council. Uh, she was head of the negotiation team for the accession of Serbia into the European Union uh, during 2013-2019, and she's professor at the Faculty of Political Science in, in Belgrade. Uh, from 2005 to 2009, she has been director of the European Integration Office of the Government of, of Serbia. Uh, the other panelist is Igor Stix, born in Sarajevo in 1997. So he was a teenager when, when the war started and he fled with his family to Croatia. Uh, and now, he's, uh, now cu currently he lives in Belgrade. He taught in Edinburgh uh, and uh, in, uh, uh, in political science in Edinburgh and the Faculty of Media and Communication he's teaching now in, in Belgrade. Um, he has published several volumes several volumes of, uh, about politics, uh, one of them with uh, Sergej Horvat, and uh, he is also, um, he is also a well-known writer. His novels are published in, in several uh, languages of the world. Uh, now, let us, uh, and at the end of the, the, the uh, and at the end of the presentations, uh, uh, the, the attendants uh, could uh, ask questions uh, to the to the uh, uh, to, to, to the panelists. Now, uh, hoping that the other uh, panelists will will uh, uh, in the will, will join us in the meantime. Let's start with the, with uh, Professor Igor Stix. Thank you, Igor. Thank you, Baskim. Thank you uh, for inviting me to this uh, to this panel, uh, and um, I would be happy to share my thoughts about the questions of, of, of course, economic or socio-economic conditions of the youth in the Balkans. Uh, um, uh, I'm not sure if I'm allowed to share screen to to show uh, just one photo. Is that possible? Uh, it should be possible down of your screen. There is a uh -huh. management panel. And uh -huh. the fourth one is share screen. Ah, then share you screen. can you can pick from there your desktop. Ah, all right. I can. All right. Okay. Okay. I'll try to. I'll try to 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 do this. Uh, just a second. Um, I'll try to show you a very interesting thing I uh, I discovered. Now let me see. I have to. Um, uh, that might tell you about the. <laughs> about how things change for the worse and where 